way that AI works is with neural networks, and this is pretty much a decision tree of if this, if that goes down and you have these aspects. The, the ultimate goal of that is to arrive at a most likely answer. But because you've got a most likely answer, it will be associated with probabilities. And again, it will still need someone to distinguish. You know, if there's two very likely diagnoses, you know, uh, you know, a 52% versus a 48%. And the other way is a, an image dissection, uh, effectively, or a dissemination. So AI works not in a very uh, large image. It will actually break an image all down and then pretty much do it in little pieces. The problem with that is you'll lose the overall morphology. You will uh, lose sort of the... Uh, the architecture that's there, but you might find really useful small parts that either could be missed or need to take a long time to find for a pathologist. It will be of assistance to help us either identify certain aspects in tissue uh, or to help us guide us into certain areas of diagnosis. They're not designing it to replace pathologists because that would not get support. It wouldn't be purchased. It wouldn't be uh, beneficial. Uh, and so this technology has been designed to assist pathologists with reporting to reduce our uh, workload. Uh, and hopefully it will improve sort of the patient care with accurate re reporting. So that's all welcome. We're already years away from the digital imagery uh, technology being used routinely in, in laboratory, let alone then having a artificial intelligence analyzing that imagery and then giving us guidance. So I, I, my best guess is, you know, 10 years away at least. This is still in research area and I, and I think from, you know, experience about five to 10 years takes often takes a long time for things just to get uh, into the, the mainstream laboratory. What we're hoping is that patients will have more accurate results, uh, the pathologist will have assistance in reporting and it will produce better turnaround times for patients and have quicker results.